Hello and welcome back to Risk of Rain Returns. We have covered every major main character now. So one of the things that I want to do is I want to do a few kind of longer, potentially looping endless runs to get some of these more interesting non-Providence trial uh, upgrades. And one of the ones that I was most interested in is actually handy. We have to get a golden drone, which will, will require looping. Um, and we also have to get the Salmerang and kill 15 enemies at once. So we're going to go into that and let's just see how this goes. I uh, was pretty surprised. I haven't actually played Handy that much. And whenever I played him for the first time on the video for Handy in Returns, I was just like, huh, he actually seems kind of up my alley. We're going to, we are taking the alternate secondary here, which makes it so that whenever we send our drones off at things, instead of them healing us, they'll give us attack speed. I think it's kind of like a either or situation there um ideally i do want the cannon drones um that i know exist that basically make it so that uh you shoot your your drones in a straight line in front of you and they hit things and just do massive damage that sounds like the most fun but we're currently unlocking that so like that's kind of the point in this video I wonder how long this buff lasts. Oh, it gets doubled by going into that form? Hmm. No, okay. It's not, it wasn't getting doubled by that. I just, I don't know what I'm talking about. I mean, this is pretty cool, actually. I lost my healing, but, like, I have a lot of damage now. And I'm a, I'm a glass tank, uh, or a glass cannon person every single time in every single game, so taking damage over healing is just, like, a, just a yes for me. There is a little bit of healing. We need to find the teleporter pretty soon, though. Unfortunately, this is one of the largest maps that is in Risk of Rain Returns. So finding the teleporter on this particular map can be a definite challenge. It is attack speed, right? Our drone, temporary gaining attack speed. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Oh my gosh. Where is this teleporter? I'm sure I, I missed it by like a small amount or something like that. I think we already checked up top there. I'm not 100%. God damn it. I'm not 100% sure that we did. So we'll check real quick. Finding the teleporter in Risk of Rain Returns is like, ugh. So much, so much trouble sometimes. Okay, I definitely didn't check up here because I didn't remember seeing a utility chest. <sighs> Where could this thing be? It has to be on the right side at this point, right? Um, we'll take gasoline. We're going to be standing in a pool of enemies quite often, so gasoline seems seems like a good choice. There we go. There we go. Let's hit it right away.
I might die. In fact, I'm probably going to die. Oh, yeah. I'm staying a little bit too close. Okay, let's try again. I do like the attack speed drones, though. They seem pretty cool. Let's see. Maybe we'll get the mortar out of there. Maybe take the question mark. Shrine of the Mountain, first stage, is pretty much an always. Not sure about double Shrine of the Mountain, though, first stage. Double Shrine of the Mountain first stage would mean that uh, we're pretty confident in ourselves. I don't, I don't, I don't know how we feel about that. We are going to destroy it and take this, though. Mocha is very accepted. We like mochas in this household. Oof. Hyper Threader might might do some work for us. Seems like you can just stack up these stacks. Pretty high. Wow. Just keep killing and you just keep getting more stacks, huh? It's a little crazy. Okay, okay. This handy is... He's a little bit of a monster. I do want a new use item, though. Um... Ah, oh, we just barely missed uh, continuing our stats there. We kind of want to meter it out then. Yeah, we'll take that. So we want to kind of make it so that uh, instead of spamming stacks, we are getting stacks over time. I don't think buying ourselves seven seconds right now is necessarily the right play. Wow. No chests. Okay. Sounds good. Teleporter's nearby. There we go. Let's go ahead and just hit it. God damn, that attack speed. Oh, hey, got his love book. Very nice.
<laughs> That's pretty crazy. Let's see if we can find an item or two before leaving. Healing chest is uh, very appreciated. Red Whip also helps tremendously. Just gets you around the stage really fast. Uh, okay. I mean, I'm the one who said it. I am not seeing any more items. What the hell? Uh, I think we need to just go. Crazy. Stage is being dry as hell. A drought. Oh, missed my jump. Go ahead and buy ourselves a few seconds here. Head to the bottom first here. I just punched my microphone trying to scratch my head. Hopefully you guys didn't hear that. Damn. Also my socks. I really need items. I was hoping to grind just a little. Come on. Much movement speed. Grind just a little bit here. Yeah, we're going to take some damage instead of the, the stopwatch. That'll help us get stacks back. Some drone there. Gosh, did I not make that jump? Hmm. Drone's not worth sticking around this long. Almost got that. Mm. The Heaven Driver there would have been amazing. Pierce every fourth attack. That would have been amazing. 
so hard to grab the red, though. I think... I think we might just need to go. Got a decent amount of move speed, but... No damage outside of our base kit. No survivability outside of our base kit. Ah, uh, this is not going very well. Ooh, that's not good. Yep. Okay, let's try this one more time. I feel like Handy kind of needs a lot of items early on. Or maybe I just need to play him better. Manage the, uh, the stacks better. Not sure. Two items right here, though. Seems like the first couple stacks don't really add a lot. Tots tend to be useful. So maybe holding on to them until we get more stacks. I need 50. Come on. I'll grab this item and then I'm going to find the teleporter. There we go. Hmm. That's okay. Not my favorite item to get. Unless I get a really good use item. Would have preferred something that gives me an immediate passive bonus bonus. Teleporter's right there. Let's go ahead. We'll grab some more items afterwards. worked out pretty well. I think we do just kind of have to, like, save up stacks, maybe. That's really useful. Uh, I'm not going to be able to get that one. I sort of did it wrong. I was hoping to... Uh copy all the imps, but then I remembered immediately after copying all the imps that the imps don't attack, so copying a bunch of imps to fight a bunch of imps doesn't actually do anything. Come on, just give me one more item game. Uh, okay. I'm fine with that. Ooh, very fine with that. I will say, I'm still trying to find the balance of how much time to spend on one level in Monsoon. I feel like five minutes is a decent guideline, 
but definitely not a swear word. It kind of depends on your character. Like, if you're running Drifter or Mercenary, a character that is kind of naturally very strong in the early levels, then grabbing less power early on for the sake of grabbing, uh, saving time is honestly not a bad strategy. But if you're running a character that needs a little bit more help, like Artificer or Handy, then maybe spending a little bit more time to try and get some nicer items is worth it. Again, not 100% sure yet. We're we'll across the top here first. Oh, hey, we keep stacks between levels. Good to know. We don't keep drones between levels, though. Jar of Souls here will be relatively useful for the boss. And potentially, if we don't find something better for the later stages. I think I'm going to come back and activate this, aim to activate this around seven minutes. I want to find like maybe one chest or two. that over there? Uh, that was not a chest. Missing out on the healing, that's for sure. I sometimes hate this level. I can never find any chests on this level. I swear it's almost always dry. There's a drone there. Not the worst thing in the world to take a drone. But I think, realistically speaking, we need to just head back. Yeah, we'll be a little late. But that's okay. I mean, we didn't get any items this stage. Maybe there'll be something on the left here right before we actually go up to the teleporter. Can always, can always hope, right? A uh, drone is a little bit more damage. There's at least that. Drones are really good in Mission Rain Returns. Don't underestimate them. Now, this drone is not very good. Oh, yeah, we also need to be good in drones anyways, because we need a golden drone. Look at that attack speed! I am very happy for Frost Relic. I mean, we killed that really, really fast, so we can go looking for some more chests right nearby here. Maybe there'll be something on the left. We already checked up here. Yeah, I think we have. Uh, come on. Nothing. Okay. Gotta go. The 
forward hitbox of this hammer is enormous. Hmm. We really need some items. Jesus, we only have, what, six, nine items? Like, barely under four items per level. There's a utility chest. I don't feel particularly strong, but I do feel like we could probably just manhandle our way through it. Maybe get a better use item. That's probably better, to be honest. So four stacks is where it starts feeling good. So we should save up for four stacks all the time. about free drone I promise I promise maybe crowbar is okay not amazing two chests here we can oh come on I walked off immediately because I thought it was going to spawn me up on the right side there So freaking thank you. Should be enough for a chest now, right? Two gold off. No, no, no. Don't walk off the edge. That's something, I guess. Maybe time for teleporter. It's not up there. We would have seen the red particles. Oh, this is a dead end. so slow okay so that if, if this is a dead end it means that the teleporter is probably up left but we're going to come over here and grab this item real quick Maybe this one 295 thank goodness we have enough this left oil that actually helps quite a bit that was worth our time so it's somewhere on the left here possibly up left Okay. Wait, we can't take <laughs> we can't take jets while old times frozen? That's a really interesting interaction. Uh blighted macro. 
and a scavenger. That's... Okay. Uh, Blighted Macrope is, um, yeah. I, I don't know how to handle that. That is, uh, okay. I'm gonna try this one more time. I, what? I guess they do, I always thought the Macropes only did damage whenever they landed. I guess they do damage on touch as well. Because he touched me and basically obliterated me. I mean, he's blighted. Of course he obliterated me, but like... Oof. I really want this alternate drone thing. I think it's going to be a lot of fun. The game just won't give it to me. Like, we have to get a pretty damn good run going in order to be able to survive long enough in order to be able to get a golden drone. Let alone have we ever... Oh my gosh. That is completely useless. Can we just remove that from the game, please? It's like, I feel like this kit is really good, but at the same time... Maybe not? I don't... I don't know. We probably should have checked up left before jumping down here. For the teleporter. I don't know, is it just me? Or is this kit for handy kind of like... Hit or miss. I honestly think it's really good. I just... I need the saw. Saw is not part of my final build on what I want to do with Handy, but the saw plus this is very, 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 very good. I just... I mean, that's kind of like the whole reason we're here, right? I need the saw meringue. And then after getting the saw meringue, I need to basically get lucky because the Sawmarine doesn't do that much damage, and I need to kill 15 things simultaneously with it. Uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and pop the teleporter. I mean, whenever you do something like this, it feels amazing. That might help. That'll help a little bit too. I'd like maybe some unhit. Sometimes I feel like his knockback works against him a little bit too. I mean, that's just hilarious. This many stacks is just absolutely amazing. Oh my gosh. That is so many freaking stacks of attack speed. I mean, I really do see the potential. We just need to get the items to survive long enough to be able to pull this shit off. Which means that since we're so item dependent, maybe we do spend a little bit longer on stages. 
But I also feel like spending so long on stages and then not getting anything is pretty much the reason why we've been dying. You know. Leech and Seed's okay. Knife is okay. Barbed Wire doesn't really do much for us yet because we tend to push people outside of our little zone of influence here. Volte Admit is literally a joke item. Anyone who tells you different is trying to sell you something. Drone here. I very much like drones. We need more of them. So in order to get a golden drone, for the record, in case you didn't know, you need three drones um, of the same type to upgrade. Um, and if they're already like the tier two type of drone, um, then they'll go to a golden drone after that. But if they're not, then you get three of the same type. They'll go up to a tier two and then you can upgrade three of the tier twos in order to make a golden drone. Did I just lose my healing drone? I did. Gosh dang it. Healing drone lied so far behind you that it tends to get hit by every attack that misses you. I feel like it's an intentional design decision of healing drones because the rest of the drones don't do that. Um, I want these items. Okay. Can't make that jump. So rude, putting valuable chests on this asinine level away behind areas that only a handful of characters can make. It's not asinine. I actually love the design of this level. I just, whenever you're going fast, you're trying to win on Monsoon. It's a terrible level to... Oh, come on. It's a terrible level to run into. Um, we should check bottom right before we get too far in this direction. I don't want to regret not having checked bottom right. Especially with how incredibly slow we are. Wow, Voltaic Mitt got a kill. It did damage. Okay. It looks like... Teleporter's probably not over here. I think I would have seen the red particles by now. Maybe? Yeah, okay, it's not over here. We had to check, unfortunately. We're going to have explored the entire level by the time we find this teleporter, though. Okay. Probably bottom right, then. Or, sorry, uh, bottom left. Bottom left. So, movement speed would be fantastic. Damage. Items of any kind. You know, whatever you want to give us, game. Whatever you want to give us. Not, not going to be too greedy. Not too greedy. Just, um... You know the basics. Uh, another drone. Can probably upgrade these to tier two gunner drones, and then from there upgrade. Uh, we'll hit this once first. Uh, that's okay.
literally being kept, kept alive. Bye, Monster Tooth, right now. This is a hilarious amount of stacks, though. Okay, let's check right here in this corner for any chests. And then we're going to get out of here. Nope. Uh, that... I thought I had a marble over by, by the teleporter. Oh, that's right. I used it to dodge an attack. I will say it is refreshing to have so much base HP. Kind of new. All the characters I play are a bit of glass cannons. Oh, we lose all of our thingies. Dang it. Our drones. Wow, that really sucks, actually. Okay. make sure we check all of our angles before moving on. Don't want to leave behind teleporter. Hmm. Could use that during boss fights. Get a bunch of damage. Oh, man. I still feel very like droughted on items. I think maybe it's partially um, psychology because I just feel like Handy needs more than some other characters do. Could be better use items like that. That helps a lot, actually. Okay, got crabbed. Yep. Oh, well, uh, this has been handy. Um, you know what? Screw it. I'm gonna go for one more. I was about to. I was about to assign this out as an outro because we're about uh, 45 minutes into the recording now of me trying to get a loop going with Andy, um, and uh, probably not gonna show all these runs at this point, but. Uh, Man, I just... I don't want to give up just now. Just yet. I feel like he's a character that... Um, he has a lot of potential to be really, really good. It's just... Hidden behind a very difficult to interactive mechanic. Well, maybe not difficult. That's the wrong way to say it. Um, it's like... I feel like I have a crutch playing this character. Um, I think we take this here. Ideally... Hey. 
we also take that other item. Uh, that's okay. It's not going to give us a lot on level 1, because it actually scales with the levels and the time. There's two drones here, though. That's an immediate power spike. We're going to take the drones. Oh, we can't afford it yet. Okay, so there's drones off to the right. We'll come back for those then, because I'm not going to just sit around and wait for enemies to spawn. Kill these guys down here. Pick up this drone at least. I think it's time to find the teleporter. Teleporter should be right there. Yep. More banners, okay. Gives me a little bit of starting attack speed. Burning Witness is, again, just kind of okay. I mean, it gives us movement speed. I guess I can't complain about that. Also another on-kill effect. And once you get going with Handy, He's fantastic. He's truly fantastic. But getting going is rough. It's like a very polarizing character, I feel like. You're either doing very, very well, or you're doing very badly, and there's not really a lot of room in between. Third drone up here. I'll happily take it. I think it's time to go, though. advantage of the movement speed from the kills here. And let's just go. Check up right. Actually, I think we're just going to go ahead and check bottom right as well. Super fast. Put the teleporter. Not down there. Okay. If we go down the middle, we might be able to... Sort of spot it, maybe? thinking about it and that honestly might be one of the strats is kind of going through the center of the stage whenever possible because a lot of times you'll be able to see the little red glow of the teleporter being nearby not a lot of times that you can do that though like for example if the teleporter is up here I wouldn't be able to see it from the bottom there
I really love the ha hammer blow. Teleporter's all the way over here. And we're going to hit it, and then we'll search the sage afterwards. Okay, that was something. Okay, Let's see if we can find anything before leaving. Big chest. More on hit on pill effects. It's something, I guess. Uh, jeez. Stage is enormous with no chests in it. Ugh, come on. Just want some items. More on kill. That's okay. Taser is... No, actually not... Okay, that's actually amazing. Um, I would say probably a good item that is should be considered like part of his base kit of like good items uh, I guess we go I'd rather be ahead than spend the whole time searching the stage and not find anything good being ahead also gets us power because enemies are weaker we don't have a use item, so that's worth considering. I think it said it was 140. little bit of seed cash get started uh, that's literally something multiple drone scrappers it's not the right kind of drone interactor I want oh hey that helps shield generator is pretty good Basically makes you invincible for 10 seconds. Happily take Red Whip to get across the stage faster. So that we can find more items. I want to gamble this shrine one more time before leaving. Forty-five for that drone. Kind of expensive to try and wait around for. Let's 
Does this bring us up to 279? I think it will. Yeah. Okay, okay. Feel a little bit better about our situation. There's a teleporter. Let's go ahead and hit it. It's in an awkward freaking place. I lost my sacks. Harvester Scythe and Colossal Neural. Both will be eventually very good. I think I like the Neural better in the long run, to be honest. Despite our attack speed, things kind of get pushed out of our attacks a lot. We're going to search really close by, super fast. Are there any chests? No, I want to... <laughs> I don't want to be down there. Why did I take that? I don't, I don't need that. Come on, no. I got stuck in the ladder. I saw the uh, Tesla go and I just tried to step over and grab it, but I pressed down very slightly on the ladder there. Oh, here we go. Yeah. Okay, that's a little bit better. Um, you know, I'm going to spend my money, to be honest. See if we can find just one more chest. Nope. Don't think it exists. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and go. We're okay on items now, I'd say. Still don't know if we're going to survive the next stage, but, uh, better than we have been. That's not really what I wanted to see. More regen is always good. I'm actually regenerating relatively fast now. I didn't mean to do that. that was an unnecessary expenditure of drone. Need some money so I can start buying some stuff. Good for now.
better than some items. Not ideal. I'll check the top area first, as usual. Just gonna let these birds follow me for a bit. Movement speed is so important in this game. I want that. The narrator drone is very good. Let me off the ladder. I'm down here now. Honestly, just keep losing drones at this point. Ah, uh, okay. Fusion helps a little. Blighted drone or blighted uh uh wisp there is not the greatest. Let's we check down here for the teleporter. Must be in that main area back there. Now look at the work that the incinerator drone does. That thing is just like truly, truly amazing. Oh, come on. to be a lot of blighteds around here. Not the greatest. Where the hell is the teleporter? Oh my god, it was nets to me this whole time. Oh, that's frustrating.
least of many is truly, truly an amazing thing for Handy to fight. Lots of ton of beads and voltate mitt are definitely items. Okay. First time to holy ground. Um we need to activate that at least once. We'll get a free drone out of it. enough yet. I just noticed a very generous thing that the game does. All of your drones turn invincible whenever you turn invincible. They don't quite have three identical drones yet, unfortunately. Would have been a great ch time to uh, get an upgraded drone, get progress towards the golden drone. Do still need a Salmerang. I think the invincibility is a little bit better than that. No. That's a bad idea in our current situation. Oh no, I can't get up there. Even a little bit of attack speed so that we had some base attack speed would kind of go a long way in this situation. No. Uh, da, 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 da. We got this. Come on, come on, come on. Okay. Yeah, look at that range. It's crazy. Let's just get up. Gotta be joking me. No way I'm taking that.
Gosh, dang it. Fucking birds. Ugh. Well, we're an hour in um, to my recording here. I'm going to go ahead and say I tried my best. And uh, we'll try this again later, okay? Not all of these are going to be wins. Not all of these are going to be successes. And uh, Handy's hard. Handy's really, really hard. Anyways, I hope you have a good day. I hope you have been enjoying the videos. And if you are, feel free to leave a like, comment, and or subscribe. And uh, goodbye.